Hello everybody, I'm going to talk about the Ludotechnic Instructional Model. First of all, I'm going to talk about the initiation models for athletics. Sports initiation is one of the most important content in physical education. Researchers focus the efforts on developing new and better ways to raise the teaching learning process. In athletics, the ludotechnic instructional model becomes the alternative to traditional teaching. Now I'm going to talk about some of the features of this model. It's focus on children for 10 to 16 years old. Furthermore, through games or modified forms including technical rules, you learn athletic disciplines, atmosphere of fun and enjoyment, addressing the social and emotional components. This model has got four parts in the session. Global Introduction and Challenge, Ludotechnic Proposals, Global Proposals and Reflection and Pooling. Theoretical Basics, Operative Conditioning, Constructivist Learning, Social Learning and Motivational Theory. Prioritize Domains in the Ludotechnic Model. In the first part, presentation of the discipline and challenge, the learning domain prioritized are cognitive and affective. In the second and third part, through the technical proposals and global proposals, the learning domain prioritized are motor and affective and cognitive. And finally, in the fourth part, the learning domain prioritized are Cognitive and Affective As I have said before, this model has four parts. The first one is about the global introduction and challenge. Here, there is an appreciation of two different performances, first session and the rest of the sessions. The first session is about the technical description, task types, historical evolution, basic rules, most famous athletes and records, and four steps of the technique gesture. And in the rest of the sessions, we can talk about the presentation of the discipline and challenge, where we can see Task types, short revision of technical description, prioritization technical phase, exemplification of the technical gesture, and challenge question. The challenge question has got some features. It's related with the technical description. It dispenses detail of any technical phase. Deduction from the information and the session. Afford to give the answer without confirming the solution. The second part is about the ludotechnic proposal, and I'm going to talk about its features. High motor impairment, inclusion of technical rules, enough number of changes. Funny, pleasurable, uncertain ending, etc. The third part is about the global proposals. Link of technical elements, elimination of technical rules, entire gesture, similar to the proof of competition. And finally, the fourth part is about the reflection and pulling. Here, 
there is a review of the four phases of the technical gesture. There is also a valuation of the activities of the session. There is an answer to the challenge question and finally there are comments and suggestions. Now it's time to talk about the material and facilities. Material. We use traditional, alternative and varied material. The facilities are varied, gym, sports carts and jogging track. The duration of the ludotechnic session is the next one. First part. Presentation of the discipline and challenge between 1 and 5 minutes. The second part, called Ludotechnic Proposal, is about 25 and 30 minutes. The third part, Global Proposals, is between 5 and 10 minutes. And finally, the fourth part, Reflection and Pulling, is like the first one, between 1 and 5 minutes. Synthesis. The limited tactical content, along with a very cold technical and demanding technique, has made it difficult to find new approaches that encourage active and meaningful learning of the child. The, ludo the ludotechnic model is presented as a proposal which is better suited for an inclusive sports initiation with examples and a well-defined and structured session that determines what the teacher's behavior should be. Ending with bibliographic references, I hope you have enjoyed this video called Ludotechnic Instructional Model.